Today is March the 14th, which is Pi Day. We celebrate Pi Day because March the 14th, which is 3.14 and then 15926 and so on, is the digits of Pi. It's an irrational number, so it keeps on going on forever. Uh, today we've been celebrating Pi Day by doing Pi Dingbats, so uh, things such as uh, Magpie and uh, other words such as Pi in the Sky were generated by kids in our year groups. We also started looking at trying to get kids to rec uh, recite the digits of Pi. Three. Pi comes from the fact that the relationship between the circumference and the diameter of a circle, when we do the circumference divided by the pi, uh, diameter, we will get pi. Uh, we can also celebrate pi if we want to on pi approximation day on the 22nd of July, or double pi day, which is the, uh, when we think about pi d, which is on uh, 6.28, uh, 6 which is the 28th of June. So when we start thinking about radians, people have suggested we have from there. Um, Mrs Hay is the numeracy coordinator who has created most of these activities. So we uh, enable ourselves to allow the kids to know more about what pi is because it is, uh, admittedly people say it's one of the geekiest things that we should know, but it is quite an important thing in maths. And it's quite important things in life. There's a lot of calculations which take part of it. Our further mathematicians use pi quite a lot in complex numbers. So it is something very important and we're very happy that today we celebrate Pi Day uh, throughout the school.